Hi friends, happy Magical Monday. I am back from my trip to Disneyland, to Southern California. It has been a really good past week and past weekend. How are you doing, my lovely subbies? How was your past week? How was your weekend? Did you enjoy it? Did you see all my posts on my Instagram? Are you following me on Instagram? I hope you are. It's Sally Hearts Jack 80. I hope you like the video I posted of my favorite ride at California Adventure, and that is Ariel's Undersea Adventure, which I absolutely love. If you ever get to Walt Disney World or the Disneyland Resort, check out that ride. It is so super beautiful, especially if you're a Little Mermaid fan or if you're any kind of Disney Princess fan. It is amazing. So yeah, I'm back. I took a trip to Disneyland last week. I did some sightseeing around Southern California. Um, my, I met up with some family. I got to spend some time with friends. So it's been really, really awesome. I went to Disneyland on Tuesday. Just for half a day, I met up with my fabulous, wonderful Disney friend, Shannon. Mwah! She is beautiful and I love her. We met up and we had dinner at Ariel's Grotto. I did not, I did take a picture of Shizuka. She came with me. She is back. She is back in her outfit. She was kind of disappointed because when we went to dinner on Tuesday at Ariel's Grotto, we thought Rapunzel was going to be there. She was dressed up as Rapunzel because that is Shizuka's favorite Disney princess. And it turns out Rapunzel wasn't there. <laughs> so Shizuka did not get to see her this time, but maybe next time. I really, really love Shizuka. She's so adorable. And she's my favorite person to take to Disneyland. Um, the first day that I went, it was super, super hot and just totally unbearable. <laughs> but I had a lot of fun with Shannon and with my family there. And then the next day, we didn't go to Disneyland. We did some, um, we went to some antique shops. We went around looking at different, like, hobby stores. And then that's when I found the most fabulous, amazing store ever, Kelly's Toy Stop. If you guys are ever in Anaheim or on your next trip to Disneyland, save some time and go there. They have so many collectibles. Disney collectibles. Um... Barbie, oh my goodness, so many action figures, Lego, I can't even say how many, they just have so many, many fabulous collectible toys, definitely check them out, I bought three things from there, I was looking, I went to see if they had any pink box Barbie, some Barbies from back in the day, and boy did they ever, they had quite a a few, but some of them I already had. So these are the three that I got. I got Rollerblade Kira. Yes, I am a fan of the Kira, so I got her. Super, super beautiful. Then I got this Barbie Disney fashion. Super cute. And then I got the first original set of the Barbie Sharing Sisters gift set. <gasps> yeah! They are so cute. So, that's what I got at Kelly's Toy Stop. Um, I got some new ears at Disneyland. Little Mermaid ears. Because I have not put these in my collection yet. And so they were there. And I was like, yes, I will get these. And then, the only other thing I bought at Disneyland was this Princess Elena plush. Because I don't have it, and she's super, super beautiful, and I'm so happy to get her, and I get a discount there with my annual pass. So I was like, you know what, I'll save some dough and get her here instead of at the Disney store. So those were the two things I got at Disneyland. I really didn't get a lot of stuff at Disneyland this time because I have a lot of stuff. Um... And there really wasn't anything there that, like, begged me to take it home. Not saying that there's not a ton of amazing things at Disneyland, because there are. But some of them, I just wasn't really looking for stuff at Disneyland. I just wanted to go and enjoy my day and have some fun there and not really worry about buying things. Um, and I was going to do more videos for you guys, but it was super, super packed. We went back to Disneyland on Wednesday, was it? No, Thursday. Packed, packed.
packed like crazy. The day was cool, though. The weather was really, really nice. And it was really, um, oh, there was just so many graduating kids there. It was so packed. It was like sardines up in that mix. <laughs> but it was fun having breakfast with Minnie at the Plaza Inn. Um, having fun, uh, with breakfast and the Disney characters coming to your table and saying hi and hello. There was uh, quite a few of them. The Fairy Godmother, um, Captain Hook, Rafiki, Winnie the Pooh, Eeyore Tigger, Chip and Dale. Oh my goodness, who else was there? I think, and then there was Minnie. I can't remember. There was probably a few more, but I, I forget. So that was really, really fun. And then our family from um, Wisconsin came in to visit and they met us there and I got this super cool Barbie pillow handmade by my fabulous cousin Holly. It is so super cute. So she came bearing gifts. Love, love this. I forgot to post it on my Instagram, but this is so cool. <laughs> you can't get this in stores, y'all. <laughs> and it is pretty fabulous. The other cool thing she made for me is um, these Disney Princess Dinosaurs. Look at that, it's got Snow White. Don't you just love, I love like the vintage, cute little diva. They look so beautiful. There's Belle on the bottom. And then she made me a little baby to go with the mama. Super, super adorbs. Love it, love it, love it. So that is the good times that I had. So we were there, you know, hanging out. And then we came home on Saturday. And then on the way home, we stopped to have a bite to eat. And um, we, well, I, well, thanks to my cousin Holly, because she went to Hallmark. And I would have never gone to Hallmark, even though I'm totally a member with the Hallmark card and the points thing. I would have not gone in had I not have seen her in the window. And then she showed me these, these fabulous Madame Alexander 18-inch dolls. They were on sale for $32.48. I don't know what the original price was, but that was the sale price on her. Plus, I got her for an additional 50% off, so she was $16 and some change. And I said yes, and this beautiful girl came home with me. I love these dolls. I love their facial sculpt. I do love their, um, they got like very slight dimples on their face. Super, super adorable. And she's just really, really, really cute. So I got that on the way home. And then on Sunday, we got up to go to um, a swap meet here in town. And I thought it was going to be a lot better. You know, they advertised it as being a ton of toys. To me, there wasn't like a lot of collectible toys and stuff there. There was just toys. It was like a colossal yard sale, which I don't mind. I absolutely love that kind of stuff. I love to thrift. I love to go to yard sales. Well, I love to thrift more than yard sales, but it's like a huge giant, you know, it's like a swap meet. So I was there and everybody had like, you know, half naked dolls, not taking care of dolls. They want like top dollar for dolls there. And I was like, I'm not going to do it. I found a really cool Wonder Woman doll. Um, and I was going to buy her, but there was no way I was going to pay four bucks for her in the condition that she was. Her uniform was ripped. No boots. I She was really, really beautiful. But I'm not going to do it, guys, because I could go to Goodwill and get myself that same doll for two bucks. Um, there was a lot of that. You know, I love to buy secondhand dolls, but I'm not going to pay target prices for Barbie dolls. No way. If it's a vintage doll, she has to have the whole outfit, the shoes, and I don't mind. Even if it's a little bit in pieces mixed up in her clothing, that's cool, but I'm not paying top dollar. And for me, 10 bucks at a swap meet for one Barbie doll without shoes, without a complete outfit, is a no-go for me. <laughs> that's just me personally. If you guys like to do, you know, pay that kind, those kind of prices at a swap meet or a flea market, be my guest. You know, it doesn't matter. We all collect what we love, and that is amazing. But for me, I just don't do that. So Sunday was a pretty, last, yesterday was pretty, pretty fun. It was a great time. It's been a great week. It was a good vacation week. It's always fun to spend time with friends and family. I just want to go to Disneyland when it's not super, super packed. <laughs> so hopefully, 
that will happen next time I go. And I'll definitely keep you guys posted. Definitely keep posting on my Instagram. And I will definitely try to shoot more videos. I think I'm going to do more ride videos. And maybe do a shopping video. The reason why I didn't do a shopping video, guys, is because I didn't really shop. Um, but I'm definitely going to post some of that fun stuff next time. So thank you guys so much for showing up today for this magical, fabulous Monday. I hope you guys are having a good day out there. I hope your past week was amazing and your weekend was a blast as well. Remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this life is beautiful world, <laughs> when you mix it up with a little bit of Disney magic and some dolls, <laughs> you guys have a magical day and I will see you for Tuesday's show this week coming up we're going to do part 2 of my updated doll room tour don't forget guys I will see you tomorrow Tuesday's show bye bye <laughs>